you and I are just like this flower. Just like this flower is unique. You are unique, all of us, as something special that makes us as beautiful. Do you know what makes you beautiful? Now the answer to that can be a little difficult to find because sometimes life is a cruel way that taking out our petals, breaking in two and throwing into the trash. And when you are broken, it's very difficult to feel special. I can remember the first time I broke. I was 17 years old. I had already flunked my high school and already got arrested. Now, I wasn't afraid of cops, but there was one person I was very afraid, and that was my mama. I can hear her scream outside the police station. Even the cops were afraid. After a few minutes, he came up to me and looked into my eyes and I see a kid coming down her face. I have seen my mama cry before but mothers cry three types of tears. Tears of joy, tears of sorrow and tears of shame. And when a son sees a mother's cry, tears of shame. That's a life-changing moment. So, my mother told me that, son, I want you to be a better man. That night, I came into my home and my dad was waiting for me. Now, my dad is a cool dad. So my dad came up to me and said, son, that's fine. You already flunked your exams and you already got arrested. That's okay. You get that from your mother's side. But now I want you to start working immediately. I said, okay, Dad. So he took me to meet one of his friends called Sam. Now Sam is an accountant and he had an accounting firm. When he came up to me, he looked into my eyes and I looked at him. And he said the most amazing thing. He said, son, I see something in you, but I don't know what it is. And I was like, what? That is the first time in my whole life who had ever said that I am something in. And I started working with Sam. And every day after finishing my work, he used to tell me story about the world, history, philosophy, and culture. And that was much more interesting that I learned in school. And I observed that I can dream and I started to dream, ladies and gentlemen. After one year, I went back to my school, completed my exams, and went into college. And after successfully completed college, I found a great girl but not a job. I actually didn't know what I wanted to do with my life. So I went back to my dad and said, Dad, I feel lost. My dad said, you're like your mother. So he introduced me to a strange club that had a strange name with strange people talking. On the first meeting, they told, uh, told me to do something called tabletop. I asked it, but while I was speaking, I see a strange man seated behind the row. Simple, humble, the unfailing quality of kindness in his eyes. As soon as I finished, he came up to me and looked into my eyes and said, son, I see something in you, but I don't know 
what it is. If you come here twice a month, maybe we can help you to find that something. Ladies and gentlemen, today I am as a dreamer, I am a speaker and I learned the unfailing quality of unconditional love. And if you have the great people in your life, they will be able to reach into the trash can and make you whole again. Ladies and gentlemen, when I look at you, I see something in you, but I don't know what it is. Thank you.